Hello everyone, Honda CB350 Scrambler, a rendering of a round-headed retro motorbike made by Honda which will most likely be launched and be launched in the near future. Previously, patent images of the CB350 for the market were revealed. It was modified so that it could be used more aggressively like the advent of Scrambler motorbikes. The market for retro entry-level motorbikes in the 350 to 450 cc class in other South Asian countries is currently popular and quite high competition. The one that holds the largest market share is Royal Enfield, which sells many car models in this class, covering almost all styles of use. The only way Honda can compete in this market is by having a variety of submodels. Some came out. Patent images that surfaced a few months ago suggest that Honda is developing a scrambler based on the CB350, which will be based on the proven Royal Enfield Scram 411 formula. Increased suspension system travel changed the shape of the fuel tank to be larger and squarer. Add protection to the side of the vehicle. For starters, Honda's latest patent shows a new fuel tank that's much larger than what the company currently offers. It's also taller and has more cuts and folds to achieve a chiseled look. There is a well-designed knee indentation on the fuel tank, allowing the rider to grip the motorcycle more efficiently. This motorbike is expected to continue to be available with a one-cylinder SOHC four-valve air-cooled engine with a cylinder volume of 348 cc, which produces the same power as before, namely 20 HP at 5,500 RPM and maximum torque of 30 Nm at 3,000 RPM at minimal, mounted on the original stand-style tubular steel frame set. The Honda CB350 Scrambler we are talking about is just a fictitious name. The actual Motorola that will be launched in the future will probably use this name, or other name. Meanwhile, the launch schedule may take another one to two years because this car is still a patent drawing. But it is not too far for the Wing Camp to develop, so that's our review for today. See you in the next video.